how to get the Mandalorian Baby Yoda AR experience on almost any Android device without having to root it. Hey peeps, what's up? Manchi here, back with another video. And in this video, I'm going to show you how you can get the Mandalorian Baby Yoda AR experience on almost any Android device without having to root it. Now, as you can see, I do have the Redmi K20 Pro, which is running MIUI 12 based on Android 10. However, I have a link, which is linked in the description of this video, which lists all the devices which are compatible with Google AR Core. And that is what you need for this experience of Star Wars, Mandalorian, Baby Yoda to work on your Android device. Other than that, you need not be rooted. All you need is to download the two APKs, which are linked in the description of this video. And then you need a file manager application, which will let you install APKs. I am using FX file manager. You are free to use any file manager application, which you want to. So here we are on the home screen of FX file manager. We can go into main storage and then we will go into download because if you download the APK files on your phone directly, they will be in the download folder before we install these APKs. As you can see, I do not have any Star Wars application installed right now. So we can go back to FX file manager. First APK which we need to install is the latest AR core build. And yes, you do need to let FX file manager install APKs on your devices. So if you get the permission for that, do allow it. Once we have successfully installed the Google Play services for AR, we can go back and install the Mandalorian AR experience APK. Now, once both the applications have installed successfully, we can go to the home screen, open the application drawer and bam, here it is. Star Wars, the Mandalorian, Baby Yoda in the building, open the application. There it is, the Google logo with the Star Wars Galaxy and Lucasfilm. And of course, you will get a pretty great AR experience. Let's tap on begin. And here it is. These are the different options which you have. And you also have something which is coming soon. If you tap on the gear icon on the top right, you can configure the fact whether you want sounds or not, do you want hints or not. If you want the autoplay mode, you have a checkbox for that as well. And here is the graphics quality which you can choose from. So you have three different options, best performance, something in the middle or best quality. Choose whatever you want to, close it and let us say load. So at this point, I think you do need to be connected to the internet for it to download the graphics and the AR experience. Once that is done, we'll select let's go. And as you can see, it is saying it works only on 5G phones, but it works on my Redmi Q20 Pro, which is not 5G capable. Let us select continue. Here it is loading the hologram. And at this point, it is going to ask permission to take pictures and record video. Bam, allow that. And now it should open the camera application. Here it is. It wants you to point your phone at the ground. So it's going to start scanning and then you can place the AR experience and move around, tap on it, take pictures, all those things. And trust me, it is pretty cool and pretty dope. And in fact, other than my Redmi K20 Pro, I have also installed this on my Poco F1. So here it is, the Poco F1 running MIUI 12, again, based on Android 10. And here it is, Star Wars AR experience works like a boss and it is pretty dope. So. There it is peeps that is how you install the mandalorian baby yoda ar experience on almost any android device without having to root it and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you and i see you